Breaking news across a turnum of a demonic avatar attempting to terrorize the land, literally attempting to spread fear. Citizens who encounter this creature should be aware of its desire to bring you in close and use its multiple strikes against you. Also, be on the lookout for various minions it may summon to help defend itself in combat. It has been discovered that these pumpkins are imbued with destructive magical energy that can be harvested to use against the beast. As such, local citizens seem more excited than terrorized. KOTT News will bring you more on this story as it develops. No change in the factional history of Eternum last night as the forces of Train Hard Esports show up in Windsward and stop the assault on the vault. Turning to the weather and the sun will rise and fall as it always does, keeping the afternoon light and breezy. But around dusk, be on the lookout for a southern typhoon that may break land on the island as deep as the central corridor. Two lineups submitted for simulated fantasy combat resolution tonight, brought to you by LARPCO. Remember, if it isn't LARPCO, it's cardboard. Up first, the syndicate forces of Hammer of Dawn assail the marauders of Nirvana for control of the master fishing port town of Reekwater. Hammer of Dawn forces return after taking a month hiatus to regroup and bolster themselves. With each fight more tactical than the last, will tonight be the night. The forces of Nirvana are fighting on back-to-back -back nights after being busted at the bank yesterday. But if history is any indication, they won't be too tired tonight. In the nightcap, the Covenant forces of Here Be Monsters assault the Marauders of PvP Dodgers for Crown and Kingdom of the Western Monarch's Bluff. Here Be Monsters spread the word of the spark quickly into the northern desert, accumulating many new followers, but seeking more as they attempt to expand their influence. The Marauders of PvP Dodgers have been avoiding unnecessary conflict whenever possible. But when you come at them with your left click, they're gonna give you the old right click. We'll have any late breaking outcomes and reactions from the citizens tonight at 11. Until then, this has been War Correspondent John Chalant, KOTT News.